day. Hi, Miss Kermit. Now what are you going to read me today? Miss Kermit's going to read me the state. Uh, United States. Colorado. Colorado. Colorado was first explored by the Spanish in the 1600s, but wasn't settled until the United States received the territory in 1948 in the Treaty of Guadalupe Hidalgo after the Mexican-American War. Colorado's nickname is Centennial State because it entered the Union in the America's 100th anniversary year. It was the 38th state to ratify the Constitution on August 1, 1876. Colorado's capital and largest city is Denver, founded in 1858 by prospectors who mined gold at the meeting point of the South Platte River and Cherry Creek. The city's elevation of 5,280 feet has earned it the name Mile High City. When gold was discovered in Colorado, prospectors found ordinary snowshoes sunk into the powdery high mountain snow. Soon, they substituted Norwegian snowshoes, skis, and Colorado skiing was born. Nestled in the Rocky Mountains, Colorado now boasts more than 20 ski resorts, making skiing one of its most popular winter sports. Aspen Mountain is a favorite vacation spot in Colorado. The town first found success with silver mines and railroads. After the country switched to the gold standard in 1893, the local economy slowed until 1947 when Aspen Mountain introduced the world's longest chairlift. One of Colorado's most famous landmarks is Pikes Peak. Named for explorer Zebulon Montgomery Pike, Pikes Peak attracts thousands of hikers every year. The spectacular vistas were even said to have inspired Catherine Lee Bates to write the poem, America the Beautiful. Also featured in the cache is the United States Air Force Academy Chapel, located in Colorado Springs. Built in 1963, the chapel actually holds four separate chapels, Protestant, Catholic, Jewish, and an all-faiths room. Colorado. Mm -hmm.